Hey guys, welcome to Bano Talks, your very own technology channel. Guys, if this is your first time you are coming on this channel, I would request you to subscribe my channel and hit that bell button so that you get the videos as soon as I upload them. Now guys, there is a quick little update regarding the eSIMs which Apple has introduced in its iPhone X, uh, iPhone uh, XS Max, iPhone XX and iPhone XR. These phones were released last week by Apple and their delivery is going to start from 21st of September that is from tomorrow. So there is a quick little update which I thought that I should give you an update about this eSIMs which would be very helpful to you. Now guys uh, the update is that this eSIM technology which has been adopted by Apple in its latest iPhones at launch this technology will be available only I repeat only in certain few countries in the world and you would be surprised to know that these are only 10 countries guys which will support this eSIM. Now guys which are these 10 countries and which operators in these countries are going to support this eSIM that's what I am going to tell you in this video so I would request you that please keep watching the video till the end so let's start the video after this short intro. Now friends, you would be surprised to know that China is the only country in the world, yes, only country in the world which is getting a dual SIM tray. That is, you can put both your physical SIMs in this uh, tray and China is the only country in the world in where you can put your two physical SIMs. I don't know why Apple has adopted this philosophy or giving only two physical SIMs in China only. So whatever the case may be, so all in, in all other parts of the world, they have adopted this eSIM technology as I have already told you. Now guys, the thing is that this eSIM technology is going to be available in 10 countries at the moment and I am going to tell you the name of these 10 countries. The 10 countries are US, UK, India, Austria, Canada, Croatia, Czech Republic, Germany, Hungary and Spain. So guys, these are only the 10 countries where your eSIM technology will be available. That is, one, you will have this physical SIM and second, you will have the eSIM embedded in the motherboard of your iPhone itself. Now, regarding the operators in US, this eSIM initially it will be supported by uh, uh, T-Mobile, Verizon and AT&T and unfortunately Sprint is not supporting uh, this eSIM at the moment and regarding India, it would be supported by Airtel and Jio. So these are the operators in the major countries uh, which will be supporting this eSIM technology. Uh, another update is guys that uh, at launch when you will receive this, e, uh, this iPhones, I, whether you purchase iPhone Max or you purchase iPhone uh, XX or XX Max or iPhone XR, the names are pretty confusing you know. So whichever iPhone which you purchase at launch when you take the iPhone out of the box guys this eSIM will not be activated because Apple has decided that it would activate this eSIM after a while through a software update so after maybe after two weeks or three weeks you will be getting a software update by which this eSIM will be activated in your phones and then you can enjoy this dual SIM technology so guys this was the uh, update which I wanted to tell to you that uh, if you are residing in these 10 countries then there is nothing no need to panic no need to worry you will be getting the eSIM support very soon from Apple via software update regarding other countries they will get the eSIM support only when the carriers in their countries support this eSIM technology so let's go for the best and wait and watch what Apple does and what the its collaboration with the various carriers does all over the world so guys this was the update which I wanted to tell with you uh, I hope you have liked the video. If you have liked the video, kindly give it a thumbs up and share your comments in the comments box. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Thanks for taking your time out. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.